Hi you guys, this is Juanita from MyPinkRoom.com with another video of one of my projects. This one was for this year's um, Father's Day. I wanted to make a suitcase-like suitcase paper bag album. And this is what I came up that was inspired by Paper Phenomenon. I'll um, try to put her link uh, down below. Um, again, because it was for my dad, I wanted it to be a little bit more masculine, and I tried to do like a suitcase type thing. Uh, what I do, did for the front and the back were, these were simple brown paper bag, celebrate um, bags from Michaels, the gift bags with the handles, and all I did was cut the bottom portion off and then use this um, uh, as the cover um, for this, the... Um, um, the elastic here, uh, I just used some little magnet little clips that were real simple to attach. A uh, paper pack primarily used for this was um, Tim Holtz's Lost and Found and DCWV uh, Tattered Times. Again, for um, the spine, um, again, this was taken from Paper Phenomenon where she used a uh, chain lace and then I just embellished it with um, washers, Tim Holtz, um, charms and stuff. You know, on the back, um, this is chipboard that I distressed the edges and the top. Um, I embossed it with some black embossing powder and then went over it with then espresso dabber to kind of get this look. And then I just um, fastened it with um, the fasteners, Tim Holtz fasteners. And then that's, that's the back of it. And then uh, Tim Holtz, I don't know if I mentioned it, but Tim Holtz is kind of, um, his medals are used kind of throughout. Um, the first part of this video is going to be the first six pages. Just because um, I have to redo the video, it wasn't uploading because it was so long. So part one will be um, the first six pages, and then part two will be um, the last six pages. And the first two pages here um, were of my dad. Oh, I took the tags out. Again, lots of Tim Holtz dyes used in here. His flowers, some metals, his bird cage here. Um, used one of his little key plates here and then added some charms down here, a little bit of lace. This is a piece of his calendar from the Lost and Found. And um, the tags throughout are double-sided, either, either with um, pictures or some um, journaling. But um, the next page, page two, will kind of set the theme for how I laid out the, the pages. Um, Again, it's for my dad, and um, I put right here that I am a father, brother, uncle, and a husband. I love food, animals, and cars. I have a son, daughter, and three grand boys. So I pretty much, if you noticed, um, I did title it My World. It was The World, but I put it My World. So um, I did the pages. Every person got their own pages, which was um, my parents, my mom, me, and my brother, his two kids, my my son, and then um, I have a page of just family pictures of all of us together, and then there was, the last one was of pets, just animals that he had throughout the years. So, um, again, first six pages. This was taken from Paper Phenomena. Um, I think I might have modified it the way she had it, but um, she definitely inspired this throughout the whole, um, the whole book. Um, this is an accordion. Uh, because everybody got their own page, I try to put a minimum of 10 pictures for, um, for each person. So this was a very challenging book just because each page um, was, you know, had a whole 10 plus pi pictures. So I definitely had a lot of fun trying to come up with different um, ways of fitting the 10 pictures um, on each page. So this one was just of my dad's, um, just fun pictures that I uh, found when I was um, going over pictures to use. I went over like 3,000 pictures from when I was little to recent times of the boys. Um, this is what page number three is love, which is pictures of my parents. 
And I just, I love this picture, so um, some Tim Holtz in there. This page opens up like a book, uh, a big five by seven of them. And then um, again, sweethearts. And there's um, just, again, um, tags that I use, which were, you know, the um, photos and or journaling that he could add later on. But uh, a lot of tags, I was uh, able to use um, the tags to get the pictures, you know, that I wanted in here. Let's put that back in. Okay, so that one. Page four is my wife, which is my mom. Again, Tim Holtz. Um, embossed it with red. Did some glitter for the crown and added just a little bit of um, bling on there. And then the little hook right here is... Um, just washers and bolts that, um, that I got like from Michael's. Her page um, just opens up and then in the back there's like a little belly band and then again just um, some more pictures on tags. So what am I on page five and six? These two are of my nephews. The, uh, my little nephew Kyler um, I titled like My Little Helper because he's always with my dad. And then I have Kyler and using Tim Holtz's um, little charms here. I use the steampunk edge die at the end of these pages, um, crackled them, and then I think I just used some ink and some metallics. And for his, um, his just opens up, you know, like a book. You know, and then again, he has more, more tags. This is a glassine envelopes and then I did leave some spots open so that later on everybody can make put like a personal message in there for my dad I just haven't gotten to that and page six is my older nephew uh, his name's Noah and we call him Noah Nader so um, just kind of Noah Nader kind of just set the theme for how for how I went with this page again just a little clip um, I used a little eyelet to where um, this hooks hooks on and hooks you know and unhook it and just some bead wiring and then some more Tim Holtz. Um, this is an accordion again trying to fit 10 plus pages on here and um, I don't know where I got this from I think it was actually from one of the magazines and it's just different pockets for tags that I used again these are all like double-sided of nowhere and my dad and then same thing on the back on the back side so I'm running out of room oh look this is coming I need to fix this I think I've been having problems with it but then again um, just tags throughout right here and then this one right here opens up like a little book whoops okay I think that will do it for part one um, let me go ahead and start part two with the next half of the pictures.